after a turbulent year the Roonies are back together and celebrating Christmas Day together as a family. Pregnant Colleen shared a picture alongside hubby Wayne and their three boys as they posed in front of a lavishly decorated table, complete with gold tablecloth, glass chairs and fairy lights. Christmas 2017 feet the proud mum captioned the snap as fans rushed to congratulate her on the beautiful family photo. Colleen, who will give birth to the couple's fourth child in the new year, hid her blossoming bump in an all-black ensemble while Wayne placed a caring arm around her shoulder while dressed in a smart grey shirt and jeans. Their three boys Kai, Kit and Clay were smartly dressed in jumpers for the occasion as they happily smiled alongside their parents. The latest snaps come after Colleen made a very public statement by putting her wedding and engagement rings back on during a family day out at Lapland UK last week. Worth £200 K, the pregnant star designed her own wedding ring from exclusive New York jewelers Jacob & Company. And Wayne gave her the 10-carat chopper diamond engagement ring, worth £250 K, for her 21st birthday. At the end of last month, the pregnant star issued a statement on confirming that she had decided to start wearing the jewels again. Before all the stories begin, yes, I have put my wedding ring on a lot of people will be saying you don't have to explain yourself, don't feel like you have to do this etc, I know I don't, but I am and I want to, she said. It didn't feel right wearing my ring, I see it as a sign of commitment and I wasn't sure what was happening, she continued. A few people are probably thinking I'm stupid for staying in my marriage. I am not stupid, I know my mind and it's something I want to try and work on. Now, as well as looking forward to the arrival of their fourth child early next year, the couple is also getting ready to move into a £20 million mega mansion in the country. The Cheshire Mansion features two man-made fishing lakes, stables big enough to accommodate 15 horses and a paddock for them to graze on. It will also include a tunnel to a garage for Rooney's cars, a spa, a plunge pool, a cinema room and even an orangery in the garden. Earlier this year, their marriage was rocked to the core when Wayne was busted driving drunk behind Laura Simpson's car after a boozy night out. Speaking for the first time about the incident, Wayne said, Sometimes you make mistakes. I held my hands up. I made a mistake. I knew straight away I had made a stupid mistake and I have to move on. It is not nice. I've got children and it is not nice for them to see that and I try to move on and learn from it which I feel I am doing. Last month, 
In a lengthy and emotionally charged Facebook post, Colleen said she loves husband Wayne, even though he doesn't deserve to have his good qualities listed for the time being. But while she said time was spent apart, deep down Colleen was prepared to forgive her childhood sweetheart. I know I would be fine on my own, with just me and my children, but I don't want to live like that, I want to try and continue our marriage and life as a family, because that's what I want to do," she wrote. I'm not saying everything is fine and forgotten about, but we are as good as can be at this point. I'm not the type of person to put a show on and say we're all loved up, I'm just real. She also addressed the gold digging claims that have dogged their relationship ever since they first got together, when Wayne was a footballing wunderkind. Many critics have claimed that the couple's net worth, thought to be above the £110 million mark, could have played a factor in keeping Colleen from throwing her husband out. But she said her happiness is not dependent on cash. To answer a lot of people, not everything in our life is money related, she wrote. People think when you earn a lot of money everything is fine, yes there are advantages, but this isn't everything in life and it doesn't always make people happy. People are everything, and people are what make me the happiest in life. We surround ourselves with friends and family who are genuine, kind and caring people. While she and Wayne have not been seen together since his arrest, she's been taking holidays with the kids while he's been busy training for the new football season, it seems they're now definitely back under the same roof. But she did admit it's going to take time for Wayne to regain her trust. I know my own mind and it's something I want to try and work on. Yes, it has been a second tea time, she added. But one thing is that he is a brilliant dad. He's made silly and selfish mistakes, some he's learnt from, some obviously not. However maybe that will change? Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment your opinion, share this video and subscribe to my channel. New videos are uploaded every day.